Phenofibrate is a medication that is used to lower cholesterol and triglyceride levels in the blood. It is a member of the fibrate class of drugs and has been used for several decades to treat these conditions. In this video, we will explore the benefits and side effects of phenofibrate, so that you can make an informed decision about whether it is the right choice for you. What is phenofibrate? Phenofibrate is a medication that is used to lower cholesterol and triglyceride levels in the blood. It works by activating the peroxisome proliferator activated receptor alpha, PPAR alpha, which helps to decrease the production of triglycerides and increase the production of high density lipoprotein, HDL, cholesterol. This medication is available in different forms, such as capsules and tablets, and is usually taken once a day with food. Phenofibrate is a prescription medication and should only be taken under the supervision of a healthcare professional. It is important to follow the dosage instructions provided by your doctor and to let them know if you experience any side effects. Benefits of Phenofibrate Phenofibrate has been shown to be effective in lowering cholesterol and triglyceride levels in the blood. This can help to reduce the risk of cardiovascular disease, such as heart attacks and strokes. In addition, phenofibrate has been shown to have other benefits, such as improving insulin resistance and reducing inflammation in the body. One study found that phenofibrate was able to reduce the risk of cardiovascular events by 19% in people with type 2 diabetes who had high levels of triglycerides and low levels of HDL cholesterol. Another study found that phenofibrate was able to reduce the risk of cardiovascular events by 31% in people with metabolic syndrome. While phenofibrate has been shown to have benefits, it is important to note that it may not be effective for everyone. Your doctor can help you determine if phenofibrate is the right choice for you based on your medical history and current health status. Side Effects of Phenofibrate Like any medication, phenofibrate comes with its own set of side effects. Some of the most common side effects include abdominal pain, diarrhea, nausea, and vomiting. In addition, phenofibrate can cause liver problems, such as hepatitis and jaundice. It is important to let your doctor know if you experience any of these side effects, as they may need to adjust your dosage or switch you to a different medication. In rare cases, phenofibrate can cause muscle problems, such as myopathy and rhabdomyolysis. These conditions can be serious and can lead to kidney damage or other complications. If you experience muscle pain, weakness, or tenderness while taking phenofibrate, you should contact your doctor right away. Who should take phenofibrate? Phenofibrate is typically prescribed to people who have high levels of cholesterol and triglycerides in their blood. These conditions can increase the risk of cardiovascular disease, such as heart attacks and strokes. Your doctor may also prescribe phenofibrate if you have metabolic syndrome or type 2 diabetes. It is important to note that phenofibrate may not be appropriate for everyone. Your doctor can help you determine if phenofibrate is the right choice for you based on your medical history and current health status. How to take phenofibrate safely To take phenofibrate safely, it is important to follow the dosage instructions provided by your doctor. Phenofibrate is usually taken once a day with food. It is important to take the medication at the same time each day to maintain a consistent level of the drug in your body. In addition, it is important to let your doctor know if you are taking any other medications, as they may interact with phenofibrate. For example, phenofibrate can interact with blood thinners, such as warfarin, and increase the risk of bleeding. Alternatives to phenofibrate If phenofibrate is not appropriate for you or if you experience side effects, there are several alternatives that your doctor may recommend. These include other medications, such as satins and niacin, as well as lifestyle changes, such as diet and exercise. It is important to work with your doctor to determine the best treatment plan for you based on your medical history and current health status. Phenofibrate and other medications Phenofibrate can interact with other medications, such as blood thinners, and increase the risk of bleeding. In addition, phenofibrate can interact with certain medications used to treat diabetes, such as sulfonylureas, and increase the risk of low blood sugar. It is important to let your doctor know if you are taking any other medications, including over-the-counter medications and supplements, to avoid potential interactions. Conclusion Cholesterol and triglycerides are essential types of lipids, fats, found in the bloodstream. While they are necessary for various bodily functions, elevated levels of cholesterol and triglycerides can significantly increase the risk of developing heart disease and other cardiovascular conditions. Thankfully, there are several effective strategies and lifestyle changes that can help lower cholesterol and triglyceride levels in the blood, promoting overall heart health and well-being. In this comprehensive guide, we will explore these strategies and provide you with practical tips to achieve optimal cholesterol and triglyceride levels. Understanding Cholesterol and Triglycerides 
Before diving into the techniques for lowering cholesterol and triglycerides, it's essential to understand what they are and their role in the body. Cholesterol Cholesterol is a waxy substance produced by the liver and obtained through certain foods. It plays a crucial role in building cell membranes, producing hormones, and aiding in digestion. Cholesterol is transported through the bloodstream by lipoproteins, primarily low-density lipoprotein (LDL) and high-density lipoprotein (HDL). Triglycerides. Triglycerides are a type of fat derived from the food we consume. They are a major source of energy and are stored in adipose tissue. Like cholesterol, triglycerides are transported through the bloodstream. High levels of LDL cholesterol, often referred to as bad cholesterol, can lead to the accumulation of plaque in the arteries, narrowing them and increasing the risk of cardiovascular diseases. Elevated triglyceride levels are associated with similar risks. Strategies for lowering cholesterol and triglyceride levels. 1. Adopt a heart-healthy diet. One of the most effective ways to lower cholesterol and triglycerides is by adopting a heart-healthy diet. Consider the following dietary recommendations. Reduce saturated fats. Limit the intake of foods high in saturated fats, such as fatty meats, full-fat dairy products, and tropical oils. Instead, opt for lean meats, low-fat dairy, and healthier fats like olive oil and avocado. Increase fiber intake. Foods rich in soluble fiber, such as fruits, vegetables, whole grains, legumes, and nuts, can help reduce LDL cholesterol levels. Incorporate Omega-3 Fatty Acids Omega-3 fatty acids, found in fatty fish like salmon, mackerel, and sardines, can help lower triglyceride levels. Consider including fish in your diet twice a week or discussing omega-3 supplements with your healthcare provider. Choose healthier cooking methods. Opt for grilling, baking, steaming, or sautéing instead of frying, which can help reduce overall fat consumption. Limit refined carbohydrates and added sugars. High consumption of refined carbohydrates and added sugars can raise triglyceride levels. Choose whole grains and limit sugary foods and beverages. 2. Maintain a healthy weight. Excess body weight, especially abdominal fat, can contribute to higher cholesterol and triglyceride levels. Maintaining a healthy weight through regular physical activity and a balanced diet is vital for managing lipid levels. Aim for at least 150 minutes of moderate-intensity aerobic exercise per week, such as brisk walking, cycling, or swimming. Additionally, incorporate strength training exercises to build muscle mass and boost metabolism. 3. Quit smoking. Smoking not only damages the lungs but also negatively impacts lipid levels. Smoking cessation is crucial for improving overall health, including lipid profile. Seek support from healthcare professionals, join smoking cessation programs, or consider nicotine replacement therapies to increase your chances of successfully quitting. 4. Limit alcohol consumption. Excessive alcohol consumption can lead to elevated triglyceride levels and other health problems. If you choose to drink alcohol, do so in moderation. This means up to one drink per day for women and up to two drinks per day for men, following the guidelines provided by healthcare professionals. 5. Medication options. In some cases, lifestyle modifications may not be sufficient to lower cholesterol and triglyceride levels. Your healthcare provider may prescribe medications, such as satins or fibrates, to help manage lipid levels effectively. It is crucial to follow your healthcare provider's instructions and attend regular checkups to monitor the effectiveness and potential side effects of the medication. Lowering cholesterol and triglyceride levels in the blood is a fundamental step towards maintaining heart health and reducing the risk of cardiovascular diseases. By adopting a heart-healthy diet, maintaining a healthy weight, quitting smoking, limiting alcohol consumption, and, if necessary, considering medication options, you can make significant strides in achieving optimal lipid levels. It is important to remember that everyone's journey towards healthier lipid levels may vary, and results may take time. Regular monitoring and open communication with your healthcare provider are essential to ensure the effectiveness of your efforts and make any necessary adjustments to your treatment plan. Take charge of your heart health today by implementing these strategies and embracing a lifestyle that supports lower cholesterol and triglyceride levels. With dedication and perseverance, you can improve your lipid profile and enjoy the benefits of a healthier heart for years to come. Phenofibrate is a medication that is used to lower cholesterol and triglyceride levels in the blood. It has been shown to be effective in reducing the risk of cardiovascular disease, but it comes with its own set of benefits and side effects. It is important to work with your doctor to determine if phenofibrate is the right choice for you based on your medical history and current health status. 
If you experience any side effects while taking phenofibrate, you should contact your doctor right away. In addition, it is important to let your doctor know if you are taking any other medications, as they may interact with phenofibrate. By following these guidelines, you can take phenofibrate safely and effectively to improve your health. Thanks for watching.